We are less than two weeks away from the total solar eclipse. Now we all know wearing a pair of eclipse glasses is a must if you are wanting to look up to the sky safely on April 8th. Our next guest you're about to meet has manufactured more than 300 million eclipse glasses in the past 34 years. Joining us to share how these glasses are made and to talk about eye safety tips is John Jarrett, the CEO of American Paper Optics. John, we're honored that you're joining us from Memphis, Tennessee. Thank you for being with us on our show. Thanks for having me. Yes, definitely. Well, let's start off by what got you into manufacturing these glasses. Well, we've been, make, we've been making paper 3D glasses for 34 years at American Paper Optics. We're the world's largest manufacturer of 3D glasses, and we've actually sold over 3 billion 3D glasses in our company history. How can you safely watch the April 8th total solar eclipse? Obviously, you would like people to use some of your glasses, I can imagine. Definitely the best and safest way to watch the upcoming uh, total eclipse is definitely using a pair of glasses from American Paper Optics. Uh, we've been making glasses longer than anybody else uh, in the country, and so it's important that you buy safe solar glasses. What is the difference between a pair of eclipse glasses and regular sunglasses? Well, eclipse glasses are uh, more than 10,000 times darker than regular sunglasses. You can't wear a regular pair of sunglasses and go out and look at the sun directly. But with our safe solar eclipse glasses with the special ISO certified lenses, you can look directly at the sun and follow the different phases um, of totality. How does your factory, it's US based, make and test these glasses to ensure eye safety certification? That's a great question. So we've been making glasses for a long time. So what we do is with each batch of lens material, we send off to the lab to have it tested here in a domestic uh, U.S. lab that's certified to test the lenses. Not every lab can do that. There's a lot of counterfeit glasses coming from overseas and they're not necessarily tested properly. So we send actually finished glasses to the lab and then we, out of each batch, we send in the filter material to make sure that it's meeting those ISO standards to protect your, to protect your eyes so you can safely look at the sun. You mentioned counterfeit glasses. These fake eclipse glasses can get some people and they're not safe. What are some things people can look out for that will help them differentiate between the real ones and the fake glasses? That's a great question. I see up there on the screen, you're showing some of those. So our glasses have our name and our full address on them. Um, the lenses are going to be silvery on the outside and dark black on the inside. We're going to have the ISO certificate, certificate uh, stamp on one of the temples, um, and but we're going to have full, proper, correct user instructions on how to use the glasses. But it's really important for people to know that they have bought their glasses from a domestic supplier. We supply a lot of retailers. We sell a lot of people who resell the glasses. And then, of course, you can buy them on our website at eclipseglasses.com to be sure you're getting American Paper Optics glasses. This is a historic event. So of course you have to make some collectibles and your factory did that. You made some collectible Eclipse glasses for certain groups. Can you tell us about those? Sure, we were chosen to make all the glasses for NASA. We made two and a half million glasses for NASA. We made four and a half million glasses for um, the National Library System through a grant and foundation. And we've done glasses for Warby Parker is gonna give them away starting April 1st. We've done glasses for a lot of universities throughout Texas and convention and visitors bureaus throughout Texas and the state of Arkansas. And then people get glasses for everything, for having them for their wedding, they're getting married under the eclipse. And then a lot of businesses give them away to attract you know, uh, business and tourism, hotels. We're even doing glasses for the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. And they're gonna give away 100,000 of our glasses at a eclipse day race. Wow, you've also created a tool that can help people snap pictures of the eclipse. How does the solar snap work? That's so much fun. That product is great. Developed by a, um, a uh, formal Hubble telescope astronomer named Doug Duncan. And he developed this and he, there's an app and you download the app to your phone. And then we have two little uh, filters that you can attach to your camera lens via Velcro. And then the app helps you focus because you can't really take your cell phone out and focus and take a good picture of the sun. This allows you to take a pretty good picture of the eclipse. If you don't have a filter like this, what's going to happen to your cell phone camera? You know, a lot of people are just going to do it and it's going to happen. But what are the impacts on your devices if you try uh, to do it that? 
it could hurt your phone. A lot of people will take our glasses and hold the filter up, but you can't really safely do that. You'll see people cutting glasses apart. The difference with that is you can't focus still. That's why the app is so good because it allows you to be able to focus and to zoom in properly for taking those partial phases of the clips. Now, if you're in totality like you are there, well, you don't want that on your phone during totality. In fact, in my opinion, this is a moment during totality when you just don't want to be looking at your phone. You want to be looking at the skies. This is a really important moment for a lot of people in their lives. They're never going to forget this. I think that's great advice. And our chief meteorologist here, Brady Taylor, keeps saying the same thing. He wants everyone outside. You have made Eclipse glasses before, but how are these Eclipse HD safe solar glasses different from the others? Well, our Eclipse or HD safe solar glasses have the same really great filter, but they're a plastic glass and they allow you to wrap around your face even more and then you can keep them for um, uh, future use and you can use them to look at the sun at any time. Okay, and I mentioned Brady, he interviewed your daughter Meg earlier this month. People can purchase her book, The Moonies, on your website. Yes, that what a good dad moment. It has it on the ready. <laughs> <laughs> How has it been partnering with her? for these types of projects? It's great. She had just finished getting her master's uh, in English. And so I kind of had this itch I wanted to scratch about this book. Um, so I kind of gave her an outline. She wrote it. And then Jason here in her office got it illustrated. And it turned out great. It's fun. I don't want to give away an, a, sp a spoiler on it. But, uh, you know, there's a fun creature in the book that helps save the day and make sure everybody sees totality. I got to hear about it and I won't give it away either, but it's amazing. So stay tuned. There's a QR code on your screen to find more information for our viewers at home, but anywhere else you'd like to send people to find more information about what your family's doing. It's great. And uh, get ready, Texas. All it's right. Be an awesome Eclipse. You can still get these on our website at eclipseglasses.com. It's going to be Wonderful. awesome. Oh my gosh, John, you have been uh, joining us for an interview. Thank you so much. You have been such a great time. Uh, where are you going to be? That's my last question for the eclipse. I'm going to head over to North Little Rock and then we're going to end up in Russellville, Arkansas, where there's going to be almost four minutes there and NASA's going to be doing a live stream. So that's my goal to get over there, traffic uh, bearing, and obviously we're going to be watching the skies to make sure it's not cloudy. Okay. Which it okay. will be, I promise. Well, I hope you all have a great time and we appreciate you taking the time to talk to us about your glasses and the book and have a great time. We appreciate it. Remember, be safe and see safe.